Hi, I'm Will Fikes, and a few things that I enjoy are reading under bridges, taking walks in the dark, and playing solitaire with a deck of 51. And I'm on The Bachelorette because I honestly had nothing better to do. Hi, I'm Peter Pete, and I'm on The Bachelorette to have a second chance. Some things I enjoy are H2O and water. Hi, my name is Ethan Muck, and I'm on The Bachelorette because I came to find the woman of my dreams. Things I like to do for fun are... Hey guys, my name is Thomas Mayfire, and some hobbies I like to do are going on long walks on the beach, reading good books, and chilling at the crib. I came to be on The Bachelorette because I like the babes, and yeah. So I just met all the guys, and they all seem really nice. Um, I just, there's just something about Judah I don't like. I don't know. Maybe he's just like too tall. I think that's it. Yeah, he's too tall. Welcome to tonight's rose ceremony. Four guys, three roses, one lady. You can see what will happen next. So tonight's first impression rose is gonna go to Peter Pete. Do you want to smell it? No. Okay. The second rose is going to go to Will Fikes. Oh, of course. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the final rose for tonight. The suspense is killing me, so Haley, make your decision. Ethan Muck, will you accept this rose? Yes. Thomas Mayfire, I'm so sorry, but I will have to escort you off of the street. Dang! I don't know, it was really hard. I thought I was a good, I don't know, a good looking guy, but I guess they like shorter dudes. Hey Peter. Sorry, I'm a little late. I've been screaming at pigeons for eight hours, but come on, let's go. So my first date was with Peter Peets. He's really nice, but I don't know, he's just, there's just something about him. You know, the date was kind of short. Short, you know, but um, yeah, something's just not working there for me. You know, Pete, I feel like I know you from somewhere. It's because you do. From what? You know that one Bachelor series? That was you? And when he told me that he was from The Bachelor, I was just like, no, he's not the one. You know, tonight's decision is going to be really tough. I mean, all the guys are really great. I just, it's going to be a hard decision. Ethan Muck, will you accept this rose? So now we are on to the final rose of the night. Make your selection. I know this has been a tough decision, but Will Fikes, will you accept this rose? Quite oh, certainly, thank you. Yeah, I'm bummed. Um, you know, reject me once, shame on you. Reject me twice, shame on me. Just guess how that's how it goes.
my date today with Ethan was really great. Um, we had a lot of fun. He's a really great guy. I mean, we just walked around. It was a lot of fun. We had snow cones. We saw some really cute statues. If you can't guess the flavor, then you're fun breaking up with you. Is it watermelon? Nope. The only thing I'd say is we were going to like a bench, I don't even know, and he, he wiped off the seat, but then he sat down in it. I thought he was wiping it off for me, but he wiped it off for himself, so that was a little odd. But other than that, it was really great. Oh, so the petting, the petting of the animal. <laughs> so it was a lot of fun, but it was kind of it was kind of funny. Every once in a while, we kind of walk by, and we'd see a little statue, and she'd just kind of go over and pet the little statue. She's funny. My date today with Will was really great. I mean, we just walked around, we had a lot of fun. He got Froyo, and he wiped off the park bench for me instead of for himself, so that was nice. Um, he gave me a flower. Maybe I'll return the favor. What are some future hopes and dreams you hope to achieve with Haley? That's a good question. You know, I never really thought about it before, but you know what sounds awesome is opening a Mormon cheesecake factory in Southern Cambodia. You know, that's more than a man could ever ask for with the woman of his dreams. I'd probably call it something like tall cheesy cakes. Yeah. I just, I don't know what I'm gonna do tonight. Um, there's two really great guys there and I don't wanna break one's heart, but I just think, I think I know. This is the final rose ceremony. This rose will decide who walks home with the lady and who walks home without. Make your decision. Will fights. Will you accept this rose? I certainly will. I don't know, I just, I just thought I was gonna choose the one. I don't know, it just didn't work out, but there's other women out there. There's other fish in the sea. I'm sorry. I mean, honestly, we're just, we're so happy. I think, I think this was the right call. Um, we've just been talking about the future, talking about our plans, and honestly, I think, the Mormon Cheesecake Factory in Southern Cambodia, yeah, that, that sounds like something we could do, you know? So that's what we're looking forward to. Yeah, she said everything I wanted to say. Good morning, sunshine. Uh -huh. <laughs> what? Did you say orange? It's got three syllables. Orange. No, it's two. It's two. <laughs> it's two. Perfect. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay.
Oh, I can I can hop like a goose. So why are you on the Bachelorette? Because I like women. <laughs> you know, I. <laughs> okay. You got it. You got it. All right. Keep rolling. I really wanted to open a. <laughs> I think I'd really like to open a Mormon. <laughs> Just off the top of my head, I think I'd like to open a. Stop opening a Mormon cheesecake. <laughs> I never really thought about it before. But, you know, that's a good question. I never really thought about it before. But maybe opening a Mormon cheesecake. That's <laughs> how I almost asked for. But maybe opening a Mormon cheesecake factory and <laughs> Mormon cheesecake factory in like southern Cambodia. The woman's. My dreams. Tell them to go around, Sam. Tell them to go around. Tell them to go around. Tell them to go around. Please go around. Please go around. Go around. Go around. Go around. Children, go around. Go around. Go around. Go around. Go around. We're gonna get nowhere, but it's gonna be fun.